future of logistics is continuous driving machines. They don't stop, they just drive without people. Then they deliver their products at the factory. The factory of the future is a factory without people. We just talked about it because it's repetitive, predictable task. No people there because it's repetitive and predictable. The organization of tomorrow, your companies of tomorrow, will be an ecosystem. You guys will face many challenges. It's obvious, right? A lot of challenges. I would like to introduce a new role, which is the ecosystem designer. This person will be hired within your company and will look into all those challenges we have. And this person will find the startups and the companies and the experts who already know it. It isn't happening in Belgium. It isn't happening in Europe. It happens all around the globe. And I really think that your success will fully rely on the quality of the students and startups that are wrapped around your company. And this is ecosystem orchestration. Ecosystem orchestration is to build a layer around your company with extreme talents that actually can do the job for a month, for a year, for a couple of months, and then they go away. So you'll have different of those cells around your organization solving the biggest issue you have. If you do this, it's cheaper, it'll give you a lot of speed, and you'll still be here in tomorrow. Ja, doelgroep veranderd wordt jonger. Digitaal, VR, AR, data. We moeten echt aan de slag met veranderen. En daar heb je ander leiderschap voor nodig. En dat moet nu beginnen voordat het te laat is. Hier kun je dus kennis maken met morgen. En Bepos is ook van plan om morgen veel meer naar de mensen te halen. Om dat mensen daarmee te inspireren. Mindset veranderen, leren van de toekomst om het ook toe te passen. En daarom, ik vind het een prachtige plek. Ik word geïnspireerd door alles wat hier is. Moeten we vaker gaan doen.